Good night, everybody. Hi, good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, Anita. It's been a pleasure to have you here. <laughs> I'm so happy to have you here, guys. All righty, Anita. How's your day going so far? Is it good? It's good. How's your day? Uh, 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 a little, a little bad. A little bad. Oh, I'm yeah. sorry to hear that. But do you feel, yeah. do you feel well? Do you feel okay? Uh, uh, today, today, I, I hurt my back. You hurt your back. Oh, yeah. no way. Did you fall down? Uh, no. Uh, uh, in the last Monday month, mm -hmm. I I have been planting uh, some vegetables. Oh, so you're planting uh, vegetables on your garden, on the backyard. Yes. Okay. Uh, yes. Good. Today I I changed a uh, place um mm -hmm. uh, flower pot. Mm -hmm. I I I put my my back. Oh, maybe it was you, you made like a, a wrong movement, maybe, right? Uh, yes. Yeah, a wrong movement or maybe it was too heavy. Um, yeah. And if, because you were doing the same activity, maybe at the end, uh, it was your back was hurts. It was already, um, well, in a bad condition, we can say that. I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, it was, it is your entire body or just one part of your back? Uh, cool. the, the upper one, the, the dorsals, the cervicals, or the lumbars? Which one? Uh, the cervical. Oh, this uh, one, this part. Yes. Yeah. Mm, oh, yes. my God. And yeah. the past, I, I, I have uh, some, some problem. Ooh, oh, okay. Yeah. And now it's back. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. But you know what? Even though you, you don't feel good, that's okay if you don't want to turn it on the camera. I, I do understand. Uh, but I'm so happy that you're here. I'm so happy. Thanks. I'm so Thanks. happy because you make an extra effort to be in here and to continue studying. So um, uh, that is shows your commitment. You're willing to learn as well. And uh I'm proud of you, actually. I'm so proud. You know what proud means? Anita, you know what proud means? Uh, ¿Sabes qué significa proud? No. No? Estoy muy orgullosa de ti. I'm so proud of you. Ah, uh, thanks. Thanks. Yes, Anita. I'm going to write it down on the chat. I'm so proud of you there you go i'm so proud thank of you, you. It's uh, my, yes I'm, I'm so proud. happy i'm so happy don't worry you can uh, lay down on the sofa on the bed i don't know where you are but that's okay you can you can you need to feel comfortable okay maybe later on uh it would be a good idea if um, if you put some eyes here on the back that will help you and also like a, some ointment you know what ointment is no like big papuru like big but but it's that is kind of ointment but it's like this one that helps like um for backup problems sometimes this is not i'm not selling any brand okay don't worry about that it's just an example this is what we call in english ointment unguento ointment okay so that's that's really nice and also with eyes you can put it on the back as well okay <sighs> Okay. That will help you a lot. And maybe you will need to take any aspirin, I don't know, or any medication. Yeah. But it's, it's hey, you need to consult with a physician as well. Mm -hmm. um, I took, uh, I took. Uh, you already took a pill? Mm hmm yeah, yeah. Okay. Hopefully you feel much better and not fall asleep, Anita, <laughs> because uh, there are some pills for pains that makes you feel like, right? Like sleepy, like sleepy, yeah. So, but because uh, uh, the, uh, what, what they want is that you relax, right? And the only way that you can relax is to fall asleep. So most of the pill that is for pain problems, uh, it causes some like, the reactions is like you want to fall asleep. 
<laughs> but I'm so happy to see you, Anita. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, okay let me let me ask. So, uh, what was the day of your classmates? We have oh my god, there's a ladies' night today. We had Jeanette. We do have Daniela, and we do have Helen Mercedes. But I don't know what happened to this girl because they don't want to see each other. I want to see you. Hi, Helen Mercedes. How are you? Very good. Good, good. Are you in the yeah. reception area? No, today I'm in the bar. In the, the bar? bar? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can pick something and eat something. Oh, come on. <laughs> maybe drink something, but not. Oh, maybe drink something. Okay, yeah, but at least yeah. drink something. That would be good. Okay. Exactly. We, yeah, we have Noemi here. We do have Mr. Fernando. How are you, sir? Hello, teacher. Hello. Very good. Very good. I'm so happy to see you. All right. I have <laughs> okay. Catherine. I have uh, Johnny as well. I do have uh, Jeanette. Mr. Jose Ismael. Oh, Jose, you changed your background. <laughs> what happened? Why did you change your background, sir? <laughs> Good night. I, Good night. I, I, I am testing. A oh, you're testing the background. That's that. You know what? That one is much better than the other one, because uh, yes. basically that the that one is like a solid color on the back. So yes. so that that is uh, better because uh, it, it would uh, show your image, your entire image much better than the other. One. So that's nice. I like it. Okay. Okay, I understand. Yes, uh, it's my first time using the video in a conference. Uh, oh. I have uh, some classes in, in the university, but I don't... Uh, 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 Do you use uh, it? Don't use it camera. Ah. Okay, now you're using the camera. Yes, for this All right. Course. You mean the camera that the computer has already or an external camera, like the webcam, something like that? A webcam? Uh, it, is the computer? Oh, is that the computer? Laptop. Oh, okay, yeah. Most of the laptop has like a high definition, right, Fernando? Like 720, I think so. I think so. Yeah, most of the most of the laptops. He's he's an IT, so he knows that, right, Fernando? Yeah, no, teacher. My 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 camera is the cell the cell phone. Ah, no, no, no. I was I was uh, talking about the camera that most of the laptops has. For example, yes. HP laptop, do you already have a camera here on the front? And they have like a high definition, right? Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. Exactly. That's mm -hmm. what we're talking about. But you, right now you have uh, the camera of your cell phone, you said. For the example, the definition. Oh, oh you see it? Listen carefully. 19, 20, 1080. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Say it again. Say it again, <laughs> but in English. Come on. One point okay. Yes. One point less. You're right, <laughs> Amy. Okay, so say it again, Fernando, please. Okay. What is the definition? Once again, please. Uh, uh, 19, 1920. Uh-huh. Uh, 10, 10, 20. 10, 20 or 10, uh, 80. Uh -huh. 80. Ah, okay, okay. <laughs> All right. You're not, yes, I'm asking. You know, I'm not an expert. You are the expert. Me no. Okay. That, that's nice. That is definition for the for the camera. Yeah, we learned something yes. new. See? That's amazing. Okay, we have somebody else who joins today's class, Miss Adela. Hi, Adela. How are you? Very good. Hey, tell us something. What did you cook today for your family? It's really interesting. Uh, for dinner, mm -hmm. I pupusas. Pupus? You made Me them? Too. Me you too. You too, Naomi? Yeah. That's <laughs> nice. Uh, let me ask you. I know that the answer will be affirmative, but were they delicious? Yeah. yeah uh, of course, yeah. right? A hundred percent. <laughs> That's amazing. You know what? I also have tried in this quarantine to make pupusas because I, I had to be honest with you, right? I'm, I'm not a person who has a grown up making tortillas and I'm, I'm, no, I'm not. But I had to learn how to do it. The first one were a completely disaster. 
<laughs> but now already uh, I can say that I'm not an expert, right? But I can make tortillas and also pupusas. And yeah, the same for me. I learned in the the quarantine. Academy. Yeah, in the quarantine. Oh, in academy, you said? No, in my house. Ah, at home. <laughs> oh, okay. So no. like, well, right. I was like, hey, there's academy to make. No. That's amazing. No, <laughs> but but I learned new recipe. New recipes. Recipes in the TV. Yeah. yeah, me too. The gourmet. Gourmet. Oh, gourmet. That's nice. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, I learned to um, prepare. In my case, I love Asian food a lot. So I prepare. I learned to prepare something new. What I would like to learn, but I need to save a little bit of money because those ingredients are a little bit expensive, is try to make sushi by your own. Because uh -huh. I, I, like lo I love it. That's my favorite food, actually. And, uh, but I need to learn how to prepare it. Okay? And I need to buy the ingredients. And they're a little bit expensive. So I need to like, save a little bit of money and then go shopping, right? But, but that will be like a goal in, uh, in two or three a month, maybe. <laughs> maybe it's a possibility. All righty. That's nice. So we have two girls that made pupusas for their family today. Okay. Mm, Mr. Carlos Jarevaro, what about you? Good night, sir. I can't, we cannot hear you. Sorry. I know you have a microphone on, but we cannot hear you. Maybe you need to click on the audio on the Zoom to select the, the speakers or the, the headsets. No. Yes, 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 much better. Yeah, thank you. Okay, so I'm sorry. I have a mute. Uh, hi, teacher. How are hi. you? Hi. Pretty good. How are you? What about you? I was sleeping. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I noticed that. <laughs> I'm not just kidding. <laughs> really? Yeah. Hey, lucky you. I wish I could sleep as well. Uh, yeah, yes, I was yeah. Too. yeah, I, I know. Stopped. Friday, Friday, the body knows that it's Friday, right? Yay! Yeah. Almost weekend, yeah! Thanks God. Thanks God, yes, definitely. We love weekends, right? Well, we cannot get uh, hanging out like we used to, but we can uh, rest a little bit, a little bit. Okay, we have Christian. Christian, how are you? I love your headsets, by the way. Nining. Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you? How's your day going? What did you do today? Uh, very good. Oh, really? What yes. happened? Tell us something important that happens today. Nothing happens today? Mm, repeat, teacher. Something in interesting that had happened to you today? I, I, I do not understand. Oh, okay. Algo interesante que te haya pasado hoy? Something interesting that had happened to you today? Oh, okay, okay. Um... um Mm, nothing. Um, nothing. I work. I working. I working. You uh, worked. You work. No, I worked. You said I worked. I work. Pardon. Mm -hmm. Okay, no, sorry. I work. Okay. I work. Really? I. Me too. Yes. Did hmm. you already have your dinner? Did you ever yes. eat? Yes. Yes. Don't yes. Tell me that was pupusas. Mm, yes. Really? Oh my God. Okay. We have three classmates that ate pupusas today. Adela, Noemi, and you, Christian. <laughs> Come on. I don't know if you did that, but that, those ladies, they are really, they are, they are a chef, right? So they, they prepare the pupusas for their family. What about you? Did you cook or did you buy the pupusas? The, I have... You bought bye, it? Bye. You Just bought it? it? Okay. See, and yes. I had to let you know, me too. I had pupusas today. <laughs> so we'll be like four right now. That's amazing. I love pupusas. I love it. But I don't have to eat it a lot because if not, I'm getting shabby, right? Yes. And that's the problem. But it's delicious. <laughs> All right. Yes. Who else? Samuel. Mr. Samuel Jackson Rosales. How are you doing today? I'm fine. Thanks. What did you do? Hey, pretty good. What did you do today? Any interesting thing that happens to you today? Uh, work a lot. A lot? Okay, tell us. We need to know about that. What happened? 
Uh, well, um, I work in a bakery, and uh, my job is uh, so I went to Sultan today. Really? Oh my God! But this is really hot place, right? Really, really hot, and yes. I'm just already came to my house. Really? So you came like uh, three seconds ago? Yes. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, and connect to, to oh, the class. I'm so happy. I'm so happy because even though it was a really tough day for you, you are tired, right? Maybe you really would like tired. to like, yeah, to fall asleep or to lay down on the sofa or whatever, right? But you show your commitment that you want to earn and you're here. And I'm so happy for you as well. I'm so happy. Thanks. Thanks. I also, I had to let you know that I send this to everybody that I'm so proud of you. You can see on your chats right now. I'm so okay. proud of you. You know what doesn't mean? I'm so proud yes. of you. Estoy muy orgullosa de ti. I'm so proud of you. Okay. Thanks, teacher. Thank you. No, thank you. Thank you for showing the commitment and being here. Today we're going to do so much fun. Uh, guys, we're going to um, develop one skill that is, um, I can I say, it? it's a little bit difficult, but and it has like a many parts to develop. And it's the skill of reading, all right? Reading. Actually, um, most of the people think that read is just to read, and that's it. But no, reading is more complicated than that. So we're going to start today uh, learning some techniques in order for you to develop that skill. And, and we're going to go for a simple article, okay? And then on the next weeks, we're going to change into different type of articles of different topics, okay? That would help you not only to um, increase your vocabulary, but at the same time to develop the different um, sections of the reading skills that uh, it will help you in the future when you would like to um, make a test to double check your level of English. Remember, there's like a test that calls TOEIC and TOEFL, okay? Those are different net levels and requires different scenarios as well. So we need to develop those skills right now, okay? Okay. Yeah, so it's, we're going to have so much fun. So today, we're going to talk about an article that is really important. And after that, uh, we're going to ask a specific, um, information about the article okay okay all righty there you go okay Ooh, i have a lot of noise in the background is it you mr fernando no no okay that's good okay so allow me just one moment let me pop it up right now the article that i would like to share with you and then we're going to move on all righty, very good. Let me just one moment. Okay, there you go. Just let me know if you are able to see my screen, okay? That's what I wanna know. Are you able to see my screen right now? Let me put it a little bit bigger. Yeah? Yes. Yes. Go. Okay. The develop reading skills. What we're going to learn today? Uh, who can help me reading? Let's start putting in practice this. Um. Let me check who's going to help me. And uh, Noemi, do me a favor. Read the expression that I circle right now. Could you please? Read it for me. Noemi? I cannot hear you, Noemi. Right now. Okay. Yes, thank you. Can you please read for me the section okay. that I circle right now? I don't know, but guessing, meaning mm -hmm. from context and reading for a specific information. Exactly. Very good. Today, guys, the part of the reading skill that we're going to develop is, for example, guessing meaning from context. That means when you read an article, not, not all the time you will know all the meaning of the words. 
right? There will be some words that it will be really brand new for you. But even though you don't know the words, you're going to learn how to identify the meaning with the context of the world. That means with, uh, with the paragraph that this specific word is in, okay? And also, uh, you said reading information, okay? Reading for a specific information. So I'm going to ask you as a question and you will need only to provide me the answer directly to the question, okay? So that's what we're going to do today, guys. And I'm preparing right now an uh, article for you, which in this case, <laughs> we're talk is going to be an article that we are already used to. In this case, we're going to talk about our neighbors, neighbors, vecinos, okay? Neighbors. Okay, can you, can you see it, guys? Yes. yes okay. Okay, I'm going, to, I want you to help me reading, okay? Because we need to develop these skills. So, okay, who can help me read this first one? The first one in black color. Uh, Samuel, can you please be so kind to read it for me, the first point? The woman in the apartment upstairs play her piano after midnight. Okay, do it again because you're missing one S. Go ahead, do it again. The woman in the apartment upstairs plays her piano after mi midnight. Very good. Plays, exactly. That's what I want to hear. Excellent, Samuel. Uh, 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 uh. Who's next? Fernando. Okay. The family crossed the street, never, never thinks of, of, the, of their yard. The garbage blows into your into in blows into your jars. Very good, but do it once again. You can do it again, please. Okay. The family cruise the, the mm -hmm. family cross the streets. The family across the street. Very good. Uh -huh. Never never ding. Never dings or never clings. Never dims. No, clings. Okay. Never clings. Of their yard. The garbage blows into your yard. Very good. Okay, very good. So in this case, let me double check really quickly. The family across that across the street never cleans up. Cleans up, guys. Cleans okay. up is a phrasal verb. So it's cleans up. One together. Cleans up their yard. The cleans garbage the yard. blows into your yard. Blows into. Okay. Blows, blows into. Blows. One together. Blows. These two. This one is, um, and this one cleans up is what we call phrasal verb, okay? We're going to see that later on. We're not going to focus on this right now, but we're going to see it later on. And last but not least, uh, Daniela, could you please be so kind to read for me the third one? Okay. The guy, ne the guy next door always parks his car in front of your driveway. Very good, but could you please read it one more time? You're missing one S right now. Okay. The guy next door always parks his car in front of your driveway. Very good. Okay, now you pronounce the, um, the S, but I want you to read it one more time because I don't want you to stop. I want you to read it with once. <laughs> so okay. do me a favor. Take a okay. deep breath, like, whew, and then read it. Go ahead. The guy next door always parks his cars in front of your driveway. Okay, very good. But now you're missing the S. I parked uh, his car. Yeah, yeah. You can say the guy next door always parks his car in front of your driveway. Like that. Go, go ahead. You can do it. <laughs> the guy next door always parks his car in front of your driveway. Very good. A little bit much better. A little bit faster if you don't mind. Go ahead again. <laughs> The guy next door always parks, parks his car oh. in front of... I don't. You can do it again. You can do it. You can do it. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. Go ahead. You can do it. Again. The please. guy next door always parks his cars in front of your... In uh. front of your driveway. In front of. Let me, let me, let's, let's practice this one. In uh, front the, of. The, in front of. In front of. In front of. Exactly. That is prepositional place. In front of. Okay, so the, 
the guy next door always parks his car in front of your driveway, okay? Always parks his car on his driveway, okay? So, very good, excellent. Okay, guys, do me a favor. We have three situations here, right? The first one is that there is a woman that lives upstairs that plays her piano at midnight. That means at 12 a.m. in the morning. Can you imagine? There's another family that has the um, custom also they they put the garbage outside and they do it all the time and there's another guy that lives next door that always parks his car in front of your driveway that means um that for example you have a neighbor that when you live in a neighborhood a there are some houses that has a garage right but there are some houses that you don't have a garage and you you need to park on the street is that correct yeah. And uh, for each house, there is a space that is yours, and nobody else can use your space. But this guy used the space of somebody else's car. Okay, so tell me something. Uh, in the first time, okay, let me go back. Let's go back. In the first scenario, guys, the first one. What are you going to do, for example, if you have a neighbor, si tienes un vecino, that plays the piano, but plays the piano a las 12 de la noche? What would you do? ¿Qué harías? What would you do? Talk to the neighbor. <laughs> Talk with the neighbor. Okay. What else? Talk with, with my neighbor to explain, for example, I try to, to play the piano after the midnight. Exactly, yes. They need to be considerate, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, what else? Any other suggestion? Adela, Jose, Noemi, Janet? Christian? Maybe I buy, mm -hmm. buy, buy, buy. Mm -hmm. You will buy? How can I say, I buy, how can I say tapones? Ah, okay, uh, uh, tapones. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes, you can do it. Okay, that's another one, very good. Any other suggestion? Anything else? Okay, let's go uh, to the teacher, uh, yes, Fernando. A die it can get hungry. Uh, <laughs> I could tell you to lower it, it a bit. Okay, yeah, to lower yeah. it or to or to turn the, the piano or the volume down, right? That's good. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Okay. Now listen, remember the second scenario. The second scenario was what? That the, you have the, uh huh. The family in front of my house and mm -hmm. all the time never never cleaned hey, his yard. Uh huh, exactly. And they put it the garbage and the garbage put it outside and all the garbage comes to my house. Do you understand that idea, guys? Do you understand, Christian? Yeah. Yes? Maria del Carmen, Helen, Jose, Carlos? Yes? I get a question. Yes, I don't know I what is garbage. Garbage. Um, okay, this is, I don't, I don't, I don't need this. Okay, this is like churritos bag. This is a soda bag. Okay. So what is like it? Like a trash. Like a trash, exactly. Okay, okay, okay. Exactly, exactly. But garbage jar would be like, for example, your yard, when you have all your flowers and everything, you cut it, right? And there's a grass, okay? So you yes, put okay. it a bag, it's supposed to be like, Close it, good, right? But that happens that that person did not close it well and all the garbage comes back to your house. So do you have a neighbors that like that way that had happened to you before? Teacher. <laughs> yes, Samuel. You say one word that I want to know the meaning, uh -huh. grass. Which one? Grass. Grass. Ah, grass, okay. Um, um, Yerba, Cespet? Ah, G R. G R A. Uh huh. Gross. Yeah. No gross. Okay, so grass. I think that I, that you use O. No. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome, Samuel. All righty. So, what would you do in that case, guys? Si tienes un vecino que la basura se te vende para tu casa, what are you going to do? Mm -hmm. In yeah. my case, yes. Uh, our family put some. Uh, I don't know how to say it in. In, in English, but mm -hmm. I will use a synonym. I, we use, a, a, for example, a, barri a, a wall, I don't know, a barrera. Mm -hmm. Yes, 
Yes. So mm -hmm. that's that helps a lot from okay. the garbage of the of the neighbor. Yes, that had happens to you. You have put it in practice that before? Yes, mm -hmm. we have one. Oh my god. So you know what we're talking about, right? <laughs> yes. And last but not least, the third scenario, what was it? Who can who remembers? Christian? Maria del Carmen? <laughs> Sa Jose? Who remembers the third scenario? The person parking in front of my of your my space. space mm -hmm. Exactly. ¿Les ha pasado eso? Do you have your own yeah. space and yes, somebody I'm else has I'm parked? the person. Uh -huh, exactly. So what were you doing in this case? What do you do in this case? Any suggestions to resolve the problem? I just so, talk with my neighbor mm -hmm. and respect the limits of the house. I don't know. Mm -hmm. And with the security security of the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Very good. Excellent. So, guys, today the, the article is going to be, uh, we're going to talk about those uh, situations. Okay. And uh, basically, we're going to develop the reading. And at the same time, we're going to um, learn new vocabulary, okay? Maybe it's brand new for you, but uh, I'm not, I don't want you guys to ask me, teacher, what does it mean? No, I'm not going to tell you the definition. You need to guess the definition of that word by reading the paragraph, okay? By the context, okay? And then, after we read, we're going to go and uh, I will give you like six words and we have like four possible answers for each word. So we need to guess what is that meaning, okay? Sometimes the word has a specific meaning and that meaning is used in the paragraph, but sometimes it's different, okay? So I need you to focus on that. I know it's going to be hard, but don't worry, okay? Is the first time that we're going to develop this. You will see. Okay, let me just a couple of minutes. Let's continue reading, okay? Because we need to develop the skill right now. All righty. So bear with me for a couple of minutes. There you go. Let me share my screen. There you go. Okay, cool. Can you see it, guys? Yes, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yes. That's what I need. All right, who can help me reading? Uh, Daniela, could you please be so kind to start? Hello, sorry, I, 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 want, you to, I want you to start. The first paragraph, please, after the okay. three scenarios. Okay, have things like this ever happened to you? Again. Have things like this ever happened to you? Very good. Yes. If so, many may ask if so, yourself. If so, if so, if so, you may ask yourself, who are these people? Why are they doing this? Why are they doing this to me? Uh huh. I uh, know. Again, the, the last one, the last question again. Why are they doing these things to me? Very good. Excellent. Continue, Noemi, with the second paragraph, please. Can I read because I... I you feel... cannot read. No. The, the screen is not clearly, teacher. Yeah. Who, uh, the screen is not clear. Yeah. Oh, okay. For a moment. The, the, for, for, for a screen. moment. I can see clearly now. Who can see it? Samuel? Uh, me. Same. Yes. Yes, go ahead, please. Read the second paragraph for me. Okay. These days, many people don't know their, their neighbors. Sometimes we share a friendly wave or say hello, but a lot of people don't even know their neighbors' names. When you don't know someone, is easy to build up, build up. frustration and build up frustration and resentment. Resent, resentment. Mm -hmm. You think maybe they like to annoy me or maybe they do it deliberately. 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 Mm -hmm. Deliberately. Mm -hmm. Deliberately. Mm -hmm. 
Very good, excellent. Okay. Continue, Carlos, please. Can you see it or no? Yeah, yes, teacher. Yes, go ahead, please. Uh, be believe or not your neighbor. Again, probably... believe it or not, believe it or not. Believe it or no, mm -hmm. your neighbors probably don't mean to irritate you. Mm -hmm. Often they often they don't even know that they are getting on your ner nervous. Nerves. So nerves. Mm -hmm. So before you take a string measure for measures. Measure to measure. No measure like measure, no measures. Measures. <laughs> Measures, mm -hmm. measures to fix the problem. You mm -hmm. should discuss is with them first. Mm -hmm. Like Daniela did, I said, continue. Okay, when you approach your neighbors, you should talk to them in a friendly manner. Mm -hmm. Compliment their children or do something else to make them feel good. Mm -hmm. Uh, continue? Yes, continue. You need to finish the paragraph. Okay. okay. Then explain the situation and if you can think or a simple solution subject. It. Very good. Um, Adela, could you please be so kind to read the last paragraph for me? I cannot hear you, sorry. Another first. Yes, go ahead. Very good. If talk, if, if talking, talking doesn't mm -hmm. work, mm -hmm. if talking doesn't work, ask another person to help. Mm -hmm. This person can listen to both sides of the story and help help you and your neighbor resolve the situation. Okay. Finally, Sometimes it's a good idea to avoid the problem. Mm -hmm. Depending on the issue, it might be best to, to just stay out of your neighbor's way. Very good. Okay, guys. Was it hard? A little bit, right? But we're going to improve. Okay, that's good. Congratulations. I'm so happy. Very good job, guys. Very good job. Excellent. Okay, so I have highlighted, guys, uh, some words that maybe they're brand new for you. We have resentment, resentment. deliberately, to irritate, measures, manners. Okay, we we'll, let's let's practice right now the pronunciation. Yeah. Resentment. Resentment. Everybody, resentment. I cannot hear you. Resentment. Resentment. Very resentment. Good. Something that that was really hard for Sammy, but you can do it deliberately. 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 Yeah. Irritate. 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 Measures. Measures. No measure like mish mish no measures. Measure. Measure. Manner. 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 Okay. Do Manor. me a favor. Mm -hmm. uh, I just want you to, we're going to do an, an activity right now. Do me a favor. Okay. Try to read only this idea up to here. Only here. From belief to you. And please try to guess or uh, intenten saber or adivinar what does it mean irritate. Read it by yourself. Leano para ustedes mismos. Okay. Any other suggestions? Another? Annoy. Annoy. Okay. Uh, good. Very good. Okay. Now do me a favor. Try to read from here to here. And try to figure it out what does it mean measure in this context. Action. Okay, that's a possibility. Very good. Mm -hmm. 
for example, to call mm -hmm. the police when you have a, a, mm -hmm. a real problem with your neighbors. Exactly, that's good. Okay, you have idea, very good. And here, well, from when to manner, what does it mean, manner? Mm -hmm. Is the way you say something? Mm -hmm. The way you say something? Mm -hmm. That will be okay. You have an idea. All righty. What about this one that is um, a little bit complicated? But here, from here to here, what does it mean resentment? What could possible mean in this scenario? Keep bad feelings for someone. Mm, okay, baby, very good. What about this one? Deliberate. Do something intentionally. Intentionally, okay, very good. So you see, you have an idea, right? Okay, sometimes it will mean exactly the same meaning of the world, but sometimes it does not. So even though you don't know the, the, the world, because I remember that somebody said, hey, what does it mean resentment? But when you read it again, you see that if you read it carefully, you can have like an idea what does it mean, right? Estamos haciendo eso. Have an idea what does it mean, aunque usted no sepa de, eh, la, el meaning directo de la palabra. But if you read it back, and if you're reading the sentence in the context, you will get an idea, ¿sí? El contexto es esto, right, guys? Todo lo que está aquí. ¿Sí? Lo que señalé. ¿Qué les parece si hacemos un ejercicio? Okay, let's do it again. Okay. Okay. Oops. Resentment. Okay, I have one, two, three, four, five, six possible answers here. Who can tell me what would be the, the, the meaning of resentment here? Mm -hmm. Anger that grows over time. Okay, very good. Good, Naomi. What about number two? Deliberately. What could be? Any ideas? On purpose. Which one you said? On purpose. On purpose? Okay. Only, only Naomi is participating. Come on, guys. What about this one? Irritate. What do you think, guys? Fernando? Uh, uh -huh. Bother or annoyed. Bother or annoyed? Okay, yes, very good. All right, let's continue. What about measure? What do you think, guys? Our, our way of behaving. Measure a way of behavior. I taking in order to achieve something. Ah, no, no, uh, I stay oh. taking in order. in order to achieve something. Very good. Excellent. There you go, guys. You are really good on this. And last but not least, manner. What do you think is a manner? Idea, an idea? A way of behaving. A way of behaving. A way of behaving. Behaving. There you go. Excellent. Behaving. Very good. Exactly. Excellent job, guys. And the last one, resolve. That's easy. What is it? Problem or difficulty. Uh-huh. Very good, excellent. Oh my it's, God, you are so. Is the last option, teacher? <laughs> it's the last option. Yes, of course. <laughs> but you see, you yes, I know that is the last option. All right, very good. Okay, you see, guys, that we have learned uh, something different today. Okay, very good job. Yes, excellent. You see, we're developing that skill. This was an easy article right an easy article because there's something that you're already used to it you you have a neighbors that they uh, make a lot of noise really late that they are they do not clean right you have neighbors that always have problems so there's something that you're already used to because that had happens to you okay but the the next coming articles guys will be a little bit difficult okay 
because you will need to increase your vocabulary. So guys, we learned six words today. Which words we, uh, did we learn today? Remember? Which ones? Measure. Measure. Manners. Manners. What else? Manners. Okay. Irritate. Irritate. What else? Right. Okay. Deliberately. Deliberately. And? Resent. Resolve. Resentment. Resentment. Very good. Very good. And we're missing one, right? Resentment. Resentment. Mm -hmm. So we have, you said resentment, resolve, right? Mm -hmm. Irritate. Resolve. What else? Manner. Mm -hmm. What else? Deliberately. Deliberately. And we're missing one. No. You forgot. Yeah. Come on, come on, <laughs> guys. You, what? We have resentment. We have deliberately. We have irritate. In measure. Manner. 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 Okay. That's the one that you forgot. Manner. Okay, guys. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent job. Very good. Okay. Excellent. Any questions so far? We're good? Okay. Would you like to play? Yes? Yes. 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 Okay. Okay. So allow me one moment because I'm going to send you a link on WhatsApp right now. And I'm going to send you um, a PIN number that you need to enter. And when you enter, you need to select um, a username. For example, you can say Noemi could put her name. Or she can put butterfly, for example, okay? That that game calls mm -hmm. Kahoo, okay? Kahoo. Fernando knows okay. that. Okay. Adela as, as well, okay? So I'm going to send this information right now. So <laughs> allow me just a couple of minutes. Hi, hey guys, please, before I do that, this is on time, okay? This is time. You need to read the instructions. Okay, you need to do it fast. Okay. For some of you guys, you okay. have to see my screen because on your side, you're not going to see the answers. You're going to see only the colors. It will be four colors, okay? So you need to see my screen and then click on the color, okay? According to what you see on my screen, see? Do you understand what I'm talking about? Okay. See, guys, Anita, yeah. Janet, Helen, right? Yes, everybody understand, Jose? Christian, Jose. I didn't. Yeah, Jose, yeah, everybody. A, a little, okay. Hay un juego que se llama Cahu. I will send you the link. Le voy a mandar el link, WhatsApp. Le voy a mandar un pin para que lo metan. When you enter, you put your name, ¿sí? Para saber quiénes son. And okay. you need to read the instructions. Tiene que leer las instrucciones, okay? Uh, tiene tiempo. He has time. Eh, ustedes no van a ver las respuestas en los colores. Solo van a ver los colores. You will only see the colors. You need to see my screen. Tienen que ver mi screen para poder ver las respuestas y darle clic a que consideren que es la correcta. All right? Is that clear? Right. Okay. Cool. Yes, yes. I try to. Oh, you see, you need to congratulate for my Spanish. Come on, guys. Cute. Come on. Yeah, you need to say bravo, teacher. No. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Yes. No, one point less. One point less. Why? Come on. <laughs> no way. I don't like you anymore. I'm just kidding. <laughs> All righty. Let me just a couple of minutes. Spare me for a couple of minutes. <sighs> mm hmm. Okay, this is my kahu. Yeah, me check. Yeah, uh -huh. Yes. We have seen adverbs, right, guys? We have seen conjunctions. We have seen model verbs. Is that correct? Do you remember that? Yes or no? Yes. Yes, well, yes. yes right? We have seen yes. that, right? We have seen that. We have seen everything here. So uh, we're going to practice what we have seen so far. So let me just a couple of minutes, let me pop it up right now on my screen. 
And then I need to pop it out here because if not, you're not able to do it. Okay, so bear with me. All righty. Oh, this one is going to be really nice. Mm -hmm. I will send it to you in a couple of minutes, so bear with me. It's taking a little bit right now. I don't know why, but that's okay. There you go. It's a little bit slowly, you know? Hmm. They are very good. Excellent. Mm -hmm. There you go. Okay, there you go. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me know if you received the link for the page. Is it there? Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so now I will send it to you the pin number. The pin number is the other one, the other number. Let me know if you receive it, please. Okay, once you click the pin number, you I need to start. Know. What? What happened? Yeah. Yeah? I receive. You receive it? Okay, yeah, cool. Okay, go to that uh, website and then put the pin number, please. Okay, did you enter already? Waiting for the players. I'm waiting for you guys. But you you use classic or team mode? No, classic one. Okay. The chair. I think it's not getting out. Uh, yeah, you're getting something else, right? Okay, let me let me send you another another page. Let me just a couple of minutes because I listened. Uh, um, I listen to uh, um, a music they're not supposed to. Okay, do me a favor, guys. Use exactly the same pin, but click on the second link that I'm sending to you right now. Have you received it already? Oh, okay. Now click on the second one, please. Yeah. On the one that says only Kahoot at IT. And then uh, they will ask you for the PIN number. Try to enter the PIN number there, please. I think I'm okay. in. Okay, yes, I have uh, Daniela here. Hi, Fernando, Carlos, Noemi, yes. Samuel, I have five. I'm missing more. I'm missing the rest of you guys. I'm missing Anita, Janet, Helen, Kathy, yeah, Jose, Maria, Maria del Carmen, I'm missing you, Christian as well. Let me check. Okay, hi, Chris. I have six. I will give you one minute more. I will wait for you one minute. Okay. Well, I have Jeanette here. Very good. I'm missing seven. I'm have Ismael. Very good job. All right. I have eight. I'm missing people here. Adela, what happened to you? I'm missing you. <laughs> click, click on the second one, on the second link that I sent you through the WhatsApp. Click on that. Uh-huh. And then enter the PIN number that I sent yours also. Okay, Catherine, I have 10. I'm missing four people here. I 
I will wait one minute more. If not, I'll, I will I will play with the, the, the person that I that, that they already log in. Okay. Helen Mercedes, I send you an information so you can play with us. Sorry, I... sorry, that's, sorry, sorry. That's okay, sweetie. Don't worry about that. Oh, what happened? I have Catherine, Maria del Carmen, Ismael. Okay, there's somebody who was not here. What happened? What happened? Okay, I'm going to play right now. Okay, we're going to play. Okay. Helen, Maria del Carmen, are you with us already? I think she's not. Let me check. Yes, we have 10. Okay. Teacher, teacher Sylvia, I'm not playing. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let me share right now my screen. Let's play it. There you go. Can you see it, guys? Okay. Okay, guys. So look at my, uh, yeah. my screen because you're not going to have in your screen the answers. I will have them because I create this, this, uh, this game. But you need to look at my screen and then click on your screen on the color that you consider that has the right answer, okay? So let's start. Okay. Let's yeah, start. Adverse conjunction the model verse review, okay? It has time, guys. Choose the correct options. You have four possible answers. Hurry up, you have time. The, the, okay, the career one was very pretty and extremely. Okay. Oh my God, only two will answer correctly. No way. Who's the first one? Hey, Ismael, congratulations. Danny, you rock. Excellent. Let's continue, okay? True or false, guys? Two, we usually use it with negative adjectives. Yes or no? No. I know, make you okay. <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, that's true. Oh my goodness. Maria del Carmen, way to go, girl. Then Ismael. No, Emmy, come on. Come on, Emmy. Very good. Okay, continue. It's a quiz. According to the following formula, choose the correct sentence. Subject plus verb plus not plus adverb plus adjective. Take a look at the four possible answers. Hi. Hi, can I, can I? No, you cannot do it anymore. <laughs> okay, continue. I'm sorry. That's okay, don't worry. Okay, who's the first one? Daniela, way to go. Then Maria del Carmen and then Ismael. Very good. Continue, guys. True or false? We usually model, use the model verb can to express ability, doubt, permission, etc. That is true or that is false? Oh no. Very good. Ismael, you continue rocking. The second one who answered uh, quickly was Noemi. And then Samuel Francisco. Chris, uh, very good. Way to go. Continue. True or false, guys? We use model verse should to express necessity, advice, regret, etc. That is true or that is false? No, who said that it was false? Come on. All right. Noemi, way to go, girl. Congratulations. Yeah, you <laughs> rock again. Woohoo! 
quiz. We use it to connect two possible ideas or two negative ideas. Okay? Or two positive or two negative. Choose the right sentence. Remember, and, bad, however, or thought. Remember that. I can't read. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, oh my God. Wow. It was the first one. I'm sorry. Uh. Okay, Maria del Carmen, you were the first one to, to answer. Very good. But Noemi, you're still on the top. Excellent. <laughs> Quiz. But connects a positive idea with a negative idea. So check on the answers and click on the right one. Positive idea with negative idea. Yay, very good, excellent. Why this one is correct? Tell me guys, why? Uh-huh. I will I will double check it in a minute. Uh-huh. You see? For the punctuation. For the punctuation correctly. For example, the yellow color, it has the coma, but it doesn't have the period at the end. Right? But it's also it yeah. was also positive and negative idea. The blue color does not have neither the coma neither the punctuation. So the 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 correct answer was the first one, because it has the punctuation, it has the coma, it has the good the the positive idea and the negative idea. So you see, we also need to get used to punctuation. I'm really tough teacher. <laughs> Is my L way to go? True or false? Thought and however connects positive ideas with negative ideas goes at the end of the sentence, yes or no? Goes at the end of the sentence, yes or no? Uh, goes at the end of the sentence, no. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> Daniela, the okay. first one, Fernando, very good. But you know what? Noemi is still on the top. Guys, come on, <laughs> beat Noemi, beat Noemi, please. All right, true or false, guys? We have two more. We use conjunctions to join two parts of a sentences. Give more information, give alternative, give reasons, give results, yes or no? My goodness. Noemi, you're still on the top. The Ismael and the Fernando, way to go. Hey, Noemi, have the highest answer straight. Congratulations, Noemi. And the last one, guys. Put the sentence in the correct order. This sentence is in disorder. You drink water every day, should. Put it in order, guys. You rock! Okay! In third place, Fernando! Way to go, Fernando! <laughs> Second place, Ismael! Woohoo! In the first place, who is going to be? Naomi! Yay! Way to go! Carlos and Daniela, they were close! Excellent! Very good! Did you like it, guys? Yeah. Yes. yeah. Was it good? You see, it was really interesting. And we basically we read uh, we review everything that we have seen so far. Very good, excellent. Any questions? Any doubts? No. Okay. It's a, it's a great game, teacher. It's, it's a really nice one, right? Because it yeah. involves everybody, and you need to like think, right? Okay. Next week we're going to do another kahoo okay 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 and uh maybe at the end of the class we're going to do these kahoos again so you can double check 
okay, where you was a, the mistake, and then you can get a 10, okay? Okay. Okay, okay very good. Okay, I'm so happy to see you guys. I'll Thank see you. you on Monday. Hugs and kisses. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.